Hi, I'm Curtis from Bamboo Grove and in this video I'll show you how to keep a running bamboo in a container. The great thing about running bamboo is that they have such a narrow rhizome and occupy small spaces very well, meaning they hardly ever become pot bound. The technique I like to use when planting running bamboo is get a container that's at least 40 centimeters wide by one meter in length and 50 centimeters deep. If you have a container that is smaller than that, that's okay, and I'll show you an example of what I'm talking about towards the end of this video. When it comes to how many plants for your container, the choice is really up to you whether you want some instant density or you're happy to watch it fill out over a longer period of time. I like to pick a container where I can keep an eye on the drainage holes. So I get myself a container that doesn't have those already and to drill into the container about an inch from the bottom. Then fill that space with a bag of scoria. The next space that you need to fill from the scoria to the bottom of the rhizome ball can be filled with either quality potting mix if it's just a single container or a basic mix if it's large or you have multiple containers as the initial growth won't require that much depth and the culm growth will come from further up the rhizome. Put at the top of this layer some slow release fertilizer. Then use a quality potty mix to fill in the space between the base to halfway up the rhizome ball. Then at this point, sprinkle in some more slow release fertilizer. For the growing medium that is from halfway up the rhizome to the top of the rhizome ball, combine half your quality potting mix and half composted quality aged manure. Then place on top of that some sugarcane mulch to help retain moisture. Then give the bamboo a thorough drink until water comes out of the drainage holes. Place your planter box on a hard surface and it can't anchor itself in the earth. So the rhizomes you want will grow well and the rhizomes you don't are easily accessible to cut off with a decent pair of secateurs. This running bamboo was planted back in 2017 and is a commemorative plant. As you can see, it's filling out quite nicely, which is partly attributed to the rhizome that running bamboo have, which is small and lateral, like a rope. So it's wound itself around the inside of the pot and has lived in there quite comfortably since that time and is still continuing to grow quite nicely. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this video helpful and happy growing.